This is question number six and it carries six marks. We're asked to use for substitution u is equal to one plus the natural log of x to find the integral of the natural log of x over x multiplied by one plus the natural log of x all squared with respect to x. I'm gonna gradually transform this integral with respect to x to one with respect to u. So let's start off, u is equal to one plus the natural log of x. I'm going to differentiate both sides of this equation with respect to x. So on the left, I'll have du dx. On the right, if I differentiate a constant, I get zero. And if I differentiate the natural log of x, I get one over x. I now have an expression for du, and the expression for du is one over x dx. Therefore, I can substitute this in, and I'm gonna do this step by step. We've now got the integral of the natural log of x, which I'll deal with shortly, over now the natural log, so one plus the natural log of x, all squared du. If we look here, my expression for du is one over x dx, so I'm making that substitution. Now we know that u minus one is equal to the natural log of x, and we also know that u is equal to one plus the natural log of x. Therefore, my integral now becomes, I'm just writing it here, therefore we've got the integral of u minus 1 over u squared du. So just split in the numerator at this stage, we can say now that this is going to be the integral of u over u squared, which is 1 over u, minus now 1 over u squared. And I could write that as 1 over u squared. I'm going to write it as minus u to the minus 2 du. I know if I integrate 1 over u, I'm going to get the log of the modulus of u. So just writing this out, we get now the log of the modulus of u. I need to raise by a power and divide by the new power. So what we're going to do is raise, and that'll be minus 1, divide by minus 1, that's going to be plus now u to the minus 1 plus a constant. If you wanted, you could write this as the natural log of the modulus of u plus 1 over u plus c. Therefore, all I'm going to do is finish this off, and I can say now, substituting back, this is going to be the natural log of the modulus, now of 1 plus the natural log of x. Then we're going to have plus 1 over 1 plus the natural log of x plus a constant of integration. So all I've done is transform the integral from 1 with respect to x gradually. And you could argue you could do this all in one go. I've integrated. I've used now the log integral. I've used now simple integration of a polynomial or an algebraic term, I should say, and then simply written it out and substituted back in. So the natural log of a modulus of 1 plus the natural log of x plus 1 over 1 plus the natural log of x plus a constant of integration.